Hey guys, this is Eskimo Poodle, and we are back with Let's Play Pokemon Leaf Green on the Game Boy Advance. Last time, we went through routes 13, little bits of route 14, and little bits of route 15, and today we're going to go ahead and finish these routes up. So let's get to it. Let's go ahead and switch out Superstar, since he's actually winning on the levels here. So let's go ahead and switch with... Let's switch with Pecker here, and let's take off your amulet coin, and give it to Pecker, and hopefully this works out pretty good for him. We have a whole bunch of other bird Pokemon on the route here, so we might as well have somebody else, or another bird, take care of him. I don't know if it'll work out pretty good, but we'll give it a shot. Hey kid, come on, I just got those off some loser. Or these off some loser. You stole Pokemon, you bastard. What are, you, what are you, a Team Rocket in training? And why do you have five? That, that's a lot. You don't need five. Uh, okay, let's go with some Aerial Ace goodness here. Unfortunately, Coughing has a lot of defense. So, yeah, we're not going to one-shot him. Yeah, Fly's not going to one-shot him either because it's only slightly more powerful than Aerial Ace. Another Coughing. Okay. Okay. Let's do this. Let's go ahead with some fury, fury Attack to soften you up. Well, that actually got a critical hit, so that worked out pretty good. With the multi-hit moves like Fury Attack and Fury Swipe and stuff like that, they actually do roll for a critical hit on each hit, so it's entirely possible to get a critical hit on all five moves. It's like a 2% chance to have a five-hit all-critical hit move like that happen, but it does happen. Just not very often. Uh, let's, yeah, let's switch out because I don't want to deal with Pecorine poisoned against Weezing there. Uh, so let's go with Simon here. You know, I probably could put Bananas back on the team since we don't need the cut anymore, I think. But we might. I don't remember. Psybeam of death. Goodbye. There you go. Critical hit. Yeah, you didn't stand a chance. Another coughing. No, we'll stay out. Yeah, these all these coughings was not the best for Pecker, just for the fact that they're physically defense-oriented. And, well, all his moves are physical. And we managed to survive with one HP. Or he managed to survive. Thanks, game. I always appreciate that. Unfortunately, Simon cannot learn Thunderbolt himself, otherwise I would have taught it to him long ago. For some reason, he does not get the best compatibility with those TMs, so... He has a massive special attack, but a lot of the moves that you want to try to teach him just aren't going to happen. Calm mind, that, that powers up your special attack and special defense stats by one stage each. I hardly ever use Recover. Let's do it. Yeah, it works. Yeah, because this way we can just go ahead and buff up for a few turns, heal up, and then continue on with our day. Why not? Because I said no. Go away. I need you. There you go. Okay. And actually, I forgot some potions, didn't I? Uh, there we go. Perfect. Pecker, you're all hooked up. Let's go. Let's find something else to hit. Okay, there's the end of Route 14. Okay, so we didn't need Cut to get through this part of Route 15. Fair enough. You, General, so I think I can beat you. I'll give it a go. Uh, I'm known as a lot of things. Gentile is not one of them. Sorry, lady. And Pikachu. Pecker, you're just not having a good day, are you? Uh, okay, Fury Attack. This is guaranteed to get me paralyzed, because I'm going to hit him more than once. 
No? I should survive without getting paralyzed? Okay, I'll take it. Right you. I'm gonna force you to face your fears of the dangerous evolved electric types here and see how it goes for you. Come on, one more. Ah, so close. So close. Thunderbolt, there's a good chance that Pecker does not survive this. At all. Woo! Uh, yeah, Pecker, um, I'm gonna go ahead and switch you out for Rocky. Because otherwise, you will die. If it wasn't for that Thunderbolt, we probably would have did. Seriously, use Tail Whip. Oh, bye-bye, Raichu. Yeah, you were strong enough with fucking Static. Static is great, except for the part where it hardly ever activates on you, on your Pokemon, but it activates on their Pokemon all the time. No, wrong. Yeah, fuck off, kid. Go away. I'm afraid of bikers. They look so ugly and mean. That's because they are ugly and mean. You know your stuff. Paralyzed heal. Let's go. Uh, there we go. Bye. And there we go. Actually, no, I still need to heal. Get back in there. Alright, can I get something that's not Weezings and Pikachus? Something that you can actually fight? Because that'd be fantastic. You're perfect. Help me train my little brother. Okay, this looks like it might be a double battle. Yes, it is. Crush, Kin, Ron, and Maya. Crush Kin. Okay. I mean, sure. Hitmonchan and Hitmonlee. Two fighting types that we have not seen yet. They're both pretty fast and pretty strong, actually. Uh, let's go flying on Hitmonlee. And do not bite because they're resistant to dark. Uh, flame Whale on Hitmonchan. See if we can't get him with a burn. Mock Punch will always go first. It's basically a fighting type quick quick attack. And that did not burn you and it did not do very much of your HP. Jump Kick. Uh, jump Kick is a pretty powerful move with the drawback that if it misses, it damages the user. And his accuracy isn't all that great in the first place. So, it works. It's just high power, high risk. And there's another version called High Jump Kick, which is the same thing, except more power and I think more recoil if it misses. Fire Punch, but coming off of Hitmonchan's pathetic special attack, you don't really have anything to worry about. In future games, you do have something to worry about because it comes off as a physical attack instead of a special attack, but at the moment, yeah, it doesn't do a whole lot. Roddy, you have to focus. Concentrate on what you're doing. Okay, we'll turn it up. I'll add to our training menu. Oh, blah. I wish I had a nice sister. Uh, don't, doesn't everybody wish they had a nice sister? TM18 Rain Dance. That is another weather type move, which has... When used, it produces the rain weather effect, which uh, powers up water type moves, reduces the power of fire type moves, makes... Thunder 100% accurate, and a couple other things that I don't remember, but those are the main ones that I remember. And also with the moves like sun Sunny Day and Rain Dance, um, certain abilities will activate, like Chlorophyll will activate in Sunny Day, it'll make the Pokemon faster, Rain Dish will activate in Rainy Weather, it'll recover a bit of HP every turn. What's cool and happening? Trading Pokemon. Um, are you offering to trade? Because I don't have anything I care to trade at the moment, except for possibly my Gloom. And even him, I'd rather not really worry about. The fairy! I gotta deal with your cute charm, don't I? Yes, I do. So, fly and hope that we kill you in one hit before you do some bullshit. Cosmic power, that raises defense and special defense. So he's not gonna die in one hit here. Oh, well. He's not gonna die in one hit at all. And your cute charm... I hate Cute Charm because it activates so, so often. 
Like, it almost activates 100% of the time. It's kind of ridiculous like that. Like, some of the other stuff, like Static and Poison Point, those don't seem to activate all that often. Cute Charm seems like something that activates constantly. It's, like, almost guaranteed to go off. And I hate it. And screw off with that immobilized by love shit. That lowers my attack, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, I'm not gonna sit here and get reamed by you being stupid. So... Superstar, let's go. Yeah. Surf him. Get the extra bonus there. Unfortunately, he has powered up, or she has powered up her special defense, so she's not going to die right away. Crunch. Gee, that's a convenient move to get. Ow. That hurt. And you're dead. Pecker, you grew a level, even though you're sucking balls today. I said trade. Yeah, I said go away. That that cute charm ability is such bullshit because it always activates. I don't know why it activates so often. But it seems like it has way, way too high of an activation rate for... At least in my case. I mean, maybe, there, there might be some people that go through the game without it ever actually working on them. Which would be great for them. But I do not ever get that luxury. Okay. I'm going to try a bird versus a bird. Let's go. I'm not into it, but okay. Let's go. And we're right back to the beginning of the route, so we're almost done. Benny! Let's go, buddy. Luckily, birds, or flying types, do not, do not resist other flying types. So we can just aerial ace these guys to death and work out pretty good. Firo. Nope. We'll keep you out. We'll see how you do. You might actually survive. Yeah, you did. Okay. That's fine. And I'm curious if we'll be able to fury attack you to death. Yes, we did. Perfect. I thought you were going to get two hits and leave him with like one HP left. Because that usually happens. I knew it. Winning, losing is insignificant under this huge sky. Here, here we go. We have to try hard. Twins, Kiri and Jan. Uh, okay, Jan is a normal enough name, but where the heck does Kiri come from? I have no idea. Okay, let's go ahead and... Aerial Ace on Squirtle and Dig on Charmander. Because Squirtle is probably going to try to take out Hot Dog, if I had to guess. Metal Claw. That's the move that Charmander gets at level, I think, 14. That has a chance to raise his attack. So it's what you'd use to fight against Brock if you didn't catch anything else before fighting him. And he didn't have it in Red, Blue, and Yellow. They just added it in... Fire red and leaf green, so you had a chance of beating the gym leader without grinding too much. E, not fair. Well, you guys attacked me, so go away. Don't cry, Kiri. We'll just try harder next time. Did we lose because of me? Yes, you did. Your Squirtle was the weak link. You are the weakest link. I'm sorry. And there's all these guys. Let's not. Have you heard the legend of the winged mirages? Um, I think I know what you're talking about, but I'm not 100% sure. Donald. Farfetched. Yeah, you're not going to survive. I mean, you tried, but it's just not going to happen. Sorry. Fury Cutter, and you missed. Fury Cutter. Isn't that the bug type move? It is. So that would have done less damage anyways. 
That's not a great choice of move against me there, guy. Like, at all. Why? Why'd I lose? Because you tried using a bug-type move against a flying-type, maybe? Well, the Wing Barrages are the legendary bird Pokemon. There are three of them. Articuno, Zepdos, and Moltres. We will, we, will, we will notice them later, but for now, yeah, we don't have anything to do with those birds. But when we do, it'll be really nice. Okay, I'm going to hope that I don't die to all these... We're right out here because of the wide open spaces. Yeah, I hope, I'm going to hope Fearow actually survives against these bikers, but, well, it depends on what they have. Coughing. Okay, we might be able to two-shot him at the least. That's nice. As long as we don't get poisoned by him, we should be fine. Okay. So we took out one. Uh, feel free to not have a wheezing, because that'd be great. And thanks for not getting any attack on that level up. I appreciate that. Muck. Okay, this guy is big. He's tough. He's got a lot of HP. Let's go ahead and just fly our way to victory here. Disable. Thank you for missing. Ow, that's a lot of health that you got there, dude. Okay, minimize. Let's go ahead and aerial ace again because I'm not trying to I'm not trying to deal with the accuracy game here. There you go. Wipe out. It's cool you made your Pokemon so strong. Might is right, and you know it. Um, if you say so. I'm not really into the whole white power thing, but strong Pokemon are good, I guess. Pokemon battle? Cool. Rumble. Cool. Cool. Coffee. Okay. Another coffee. That's fine. Uh, you can have a muck as well, because that actually worked out reasonably well for me here. Uh, Fury attack. See if we can't get a miss. And that's the one that just auto poisons me, isn't it? Well, it might as well be. I think poison gas is the one that auto poisons, but whatever. Uh, Fury attack again. Try to hit. There you go. I knew you could do it. I'll suffer for five, but I'll take it. Smog does not have a very high base power, if I remember correctly. I think it's only like 30 or something like that. Might even be like... Might be 40, I'm not sure. But either way, it's not terribly powerful. And we're going to take damage in the sky. Yay! Grimer. No, we'll, we'll stay out. And you know what, we're just, just going to go ahead and aerial ace this guy because I'm not trying to deal with his minimizing junk. Perfect. Sludge. That actually hurt pretty well. Not quite enough to get me. Damn. That actually did a lot of damage with that poison right there. It's percentage based. Or fraction based or something like that. Blown away. Yeah. You did pretty good there, buddy. I'm proud of you. You know who'd win. You know who'd win. You and me one on one. Yeah, I'd, I would. Thanks. But uh, you put up a good fight. I'm not going to lie. Alright, two more to go. Pecker, can you survive? I need to burn some time. Shut up and battle. Oh, you gotta, you gotta be somewhere later? Is that what's happening? Biker Isaac. And Grimers. Okay. Keep up the aerial ace spam here and hope that they don't poison me with their sledge attack. Okay, that's fine. And we should be able to fury attack him to death, I hope. Perfect. Another Grimer. Okay, let's do it. You know, let's go ahead and 
start off with Fly for the little bit of extra damage. I don't think it's gonna be enough to. I don't think it's gonna be enough to finish him off, but we might get a critical hit. We did not. How will Pursuit do against you? I don't think it did very well, but it it did enough to kill you, so that's good enough for me. And a coughing. Okay, cool. Let's do it. Let's see how much Pursuit does against you. Not very much. Ow. Fuck, that hurt. That sludge attack actually does plenty of damage. I'm kind of curious how much power it has to get on it. Uh, if you don't survive this hit, you die. You died. Pecker, you fail at life. Hot dog, finish him off, please. But first, let's go ahead and revive Pecker, because he's about to get a level, and that'd be fantastic. Don't poison me, too, please. Okay, thanks. And bite him. Which probably isn't very good for your teeth, because that guy's probably pretty damn hard. There you go, 35. And there's that attack that I was hoping for at last level. Thanks. What? You? Yes, me. You you saw me here. I don't know why you're acting all surprised. Raising Pokemon of the drag, man. Then don't do it. I mean, no one's making you do it, right? Let's give a soda pop here. And go away. Go away. I don't think there's anything hidden in here besides the Pokemon that we don't really need to catch. Nope, there's an item. Okay. Ditto! I want to catch you, but at the same time, I don't have the... Did I buy Great Balls? Yeah, I did. Okay. So that's fine. We can actually fight you and possibly catch you. Or he can just kill you. That works too. Pecker, you bastard. Not quite what I was going for, but I'll take it, I guess. More dittos. Okay, cool. That means we're going to be able to finish him off or catch him or something. Uh, let's go with a Pursuit since that should not kill you. Okay, good. Let's see if Great Ball will work here, please. There you go. Gotcha, did it was cut. And what do we get? Capable of copying an opponent's genetic code to instantly transform itself into a duplicate of the enemy. No, we're fine. We don't need a nickname for you. You're not going to ever get out of the box. So, okay, get off the bike because I can't make these simple turns. Where is this damn item? Come here. Okay, you know what? Fuck it. We're doing this the easy way. Get rid of all the grass so I don't gotta deal with it. There you go. There you go. The sink. Alright, we got one more trainer to fight here. You are leveled up. Perfect. Or, healed up. Come on, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. You, see, you seem to be rather impatient there, sir. Biker Lucas, with four Pokemon for me to deal with. Fantastic. And... Okay, Fury Attack and then Fly. 
Or Aerial Ace, depending on how low he gets. Yeah, I don't think Aerial Ace is going to finish him off there. Thank you for not poisoning me. I appreciate that. Sorry about that pause, I was trying to open a new soda, but for some reason, every once in a while when you open a soda, or at least for me, um, the, the little tab doesn't open all the way, and you gotta use your finger to open the rest of it, so you can actually get stuff out of it, so, oh well. Coughing again, let's do it, okay, let's keep up with the free, free attack combo, or you know, miss, that works too I guess, sludge. Hecker, you love being poisoned, so I won't doubt this. You actually didn't get poisoned there. What a shock. Three times. Perfect. And Sludge does a lot of damage, so I don't know if you're going to... Okay, that did way less damage that time. Unless it was a critical hit previously. You're gonna die after this turn, aren't you? Yes, you are. Grimer. Yeah, let's switch out so you don't die. Uh, let's go with... Hot Dog again. I could be using Simon here, but there's a good reason I'm not. Grimer, how you doing, buddy? Uh, let's dig you to death. And you're pulling that shit. Could you not? You son of a bitch. I hate that crap. Flame will. There you go. Get him. Fuck off with that evasion shit. There you go. You're burned. So your attack power is reduced. And you're going to take damage either way. So that's fine by me. So you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and let you die on your own. I'm going to go ahead and heal up Pecker. There you go. You can't evade the burn, dude. Just so you know. You can try. It's just not going to work out terribly well for you. Perfect. Nope, we'll stay out. We got level coming up here, so we might as well be out here for this. Let's go with some flame wheel goodness. Perfect. That worked out great. And there's our level. There is our level with a nice special attack boost. I'll take it. Ah, get lost, get lost. Obviously you're very good at the whole English thing. What, what, what? What do you still, what do you want still? Yeah, you're obviously real good at the whole English language thing. So, proud of you there, bud. Man, you just depleted my stock of antidotes, you fucks. And again, that, that was actually a pretty decent route then. You had the one route that was full... Because if you were just coming here from Lavender Town, assuming you had actually knocked out the Snorlax or caught him to, to get over here, first you'd have to deal with a whole bunch of water types, then you'd have to deal with about a thousand flying types, and then you got a nice mixture of poison types and grass types around here so yeah you have a nice little you have a nice little gauntlet getting over here but there we go we have finished up with these roots we're never coming back here again unless we feel like versus seeking them which i probably won't but let's go ahead and head over to the mart I hate how everything has these damn bushes in the way. Yeah, you can just cut them down, but I'd rather not. Go away. Move. Alright, let's grab some stuff from here real fast. Do I have anything to sell? I don't think I do. So I'm going to go ahead and buy some... We have full heals available, which are nice. 
those re those recover all status problems at once. So let's go ahead and yeah, let's go ahead and get rid of antidotes. Paralyzed heals. And anything else that recovers one status ailment here. Because yeah, the the full heals are more expensive. But because they recover everything, it's just real nice. So if you're if you're confused and paralyzed, you can use a full heal and it'll, rec it'll heal up both at once. So that's the beauty of the full heals right there. Yeah, again, expensive, but worth it for stuff like that. So I'd rather just spend the money on them here. Uh, we don't need 95, but I will take... 20. There you go. Did I buy Max Repels? No, I didn't. I have Super Repels. I think Max Repels are... Or Super Repels are slightly more cost-efficient for the amount of money you spend on them. But... And we'll buy more when we need them. Let's see, revives. We got two. Let's buy three just to have some in there. And then let's buy some... No super potions, because super potions suck. And we don't need any ultra balls yet. So there we go. Anyways, we took care of everything on routes 14 and 15. Next episode, we're finally going to take on the gym here in Fuchsia City. So guys, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Have a good night.